As Juris Fromentiel made this ebonized long case clock in about 1660, and it's the earliest complete clock designed as a long case and known as the Norfolk Fromentiel. The engraving on the cartouche here is of a springing horse with an oak sprig in its mouth from the rebus of Fitz Allen, Earl of Arundel, Henry Howard, the sixth Duke of Norfolk, who wanted the very latest technology into his home, inherited from his grandfather, Thomas Howell, the 14th Earl of Arundel, known as the Collector Earl, his huge collection of paintings, drawings, including by Leonardo da Vinci, the two Holbeins, Raphael, Wenceslas Holler and Durer, and most of these ended up in the Royal Library in Windsor Castle or at Chatsworth House. His library and manuscripts were given to the Royal Society, who later sold them to the British Museum to found the British Library. Henry Howard, the sixth Duke, was a leading scientific patron made Fellow of the Royal Society in November 1666, and it was he who made his town residence, Arundel House, available for the Royal Society meetings when they were uh, dispossessed of their premises at Gresham College after the Great Fire of London.